Let's start solving this problem using the information we're given about the length of the particle's path inside the magnetic field. I'll call it D. We know it equals 1.18 centimeters, and we can see from the figure that it's one quarter of a circle. So the distance D is one quarter of a circle's circumference. We can use this to solve for the radius of that curved path, and it works out to this expression, which we can evaluate to arrive at this value. Now we can find the magnetic field magnitude by applying Newton's second law. The particle travels along a circular path, so we know the net force on it is directed towards the center of the circle. That force is the magnetic force with this magnitude, where the velocity and magnetic field are perpendicular, so that sine of theta equals 1 and the acceleration is the centripetal acceleration, v squared over r. Now we can solve for the magnetic field magnitude, and substitute all the known values. The proton's mass, its speed, the magnitude of its charge, and the radius of its curved path. Calculating to find the magnetic field magnitude is 1.67 times 10 to the minus 3 tesla.